Okay, we're talking draft stocks as we get ready for the 2020 NFL Draft with my man Matt Carriford here. Uh, spent four years with the Crimson Tide, and he's got a little insight on Jerry Judy. Jerry Judy, always an interesting character, somebody that I always really enjoyed watching. I would say had a breakout season. His sophomore year, obviously a Blinnikoff Award winner, and then this past year kind of goes out on a high note. So what better time to hit the NFL than now for Jerry Judy? Makes sense, good business decision. What do you love about Jerry Judy? I, I see the smile on your face. Yeah, I, no, mean, uh, I, I feel like you got some love for Jerry Judy. <laughs> Jerry's awesome. He's uh he's a guy who, you know, in the locker room cracks me up. Like he's just he's funny, he dances, he makes jokes all the time. But then it's just the kind of guy he is, he's you know, he's nice, he's willing to coach me, help me over the years, develop as a wide receiver. And then on the field, it's like you don't see anything like Jerry Judy. You know, we just talked about some other guys who have some pretty crazy athletic ability, but when you're looking at Jerry Judy, he creates his own plays. He creates, you know, moves. And, like, you don't see people who can do that. I would say he's like a Michael Jordan of football. He just catches the ball and then, like, what do you know, six spins and then he's going down for a touchdown. So I think that he's just got an unbelievable ability for that, and that's something that you just don't see in any other wide receivers. And you obviously had the opportunity to see him develop and grow, obviously from freshman to sophomore to junior year. Where did you see the biggest development in him and his abilities as a, as a player? I would say he just, uh, you know, over time learned to make his routes more crisp. And, and, and being a speedy a wide receiver, you can, you can do those kind of things. You can make, you know, less sharp cuts, but then over time just develops that ability to make better, cleaner cuts. And, again, he, he's like a work animal, too, like a workhorse. You know, he's always out there. He's the best receiver in the country, and he's putting in more time than anyone I know. So it's pretty cool. Yeah, that dude's going to have a great NFL career. Last question, best Jerry Judy story. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if it'd be it's, it's anything that great, but uh, it's definitely funny for me because he and Calvin Ridley used to be really good friends. And um, freshman year, his sophomore year, whatever, when I came into the thing, Calvin started to make a joke that because my name's Mac, I look like Ronald McDonald. What? And it's, I, I don't know how it makes sense at all, but you know they ran with it, and Judy loved it too. And uh, they would always call me Ronald McDonald and joke around, and it's just always something that's sort of funny and special to me. So. Aw, <laughs> Ronald McDonald, I love it. <laughs>